Welcome to Tapa Tuesdays! Add baking soda to your raw beef, mix, and then set aside for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, we add in a teaspoon of Chinese five spice and then add in your tapa sauce and mix. Now it's time to cook the beef virus. Just add in a little bit of oil and then add in your beef. This is how we actually used to make our good tapa in stores. What I did was I added 1 fourth cup of good tapa sauce, added in 3 cups of water, then just sliced some green onions. While the pears is still cooking, let's make garlic rice. So chop up your garlic and add a generous amount of olive oil to your pan. Then add in your garlic, toast them, and then add in your day-old rice. Mix it up and then add in a cup of your paris sauce and then mix and then set aside. Okay, so now after an hour, we check our paris, remove the two star anise, and then we make slurry. So this is just equal amount of cornstarch with water to thicken up our paris. Once it's at your desired consistency, just add in salt or pepper. Okay, so for garnish, we'll just chop a leek in half and then slice them as thin as you can. And then just shag it all up and then put it in an ice bath so that it all curls up. Okay, so now it's time to plate your beef paris. You can put it on top of your fried rice and then add in your shocked leeks on top. Or you can have it on the side. And enjoy. Please tag us when you make this.